Bada bing bada boom. Video 5. The importance of teamwork. Investing must be a team effort. It won't make it if one saves and invests, the other spouse spends and enjoys. When most people get married, the strange thing is that they share almost everything in life. Except money. Many ladies have this wonderful saying which they lovingly tell their husbands. Your money is our money. Sounds much nicer than saying your money is my money. And my money is solely mine. Law. If you really think about it, it looks and sounds kind of strange. Most marriages break down because of money or sex problems. For the husbands, it's usually not enough good sex, and for the wives, it's never enough money. Another interesting way to define wealth can be, the husband's earning power must be greater than the wife's spending power. The opposite can also be true. The trend now is that women are earning as much or even more than men. Some wives are even the sole breadwinners in the family. Yeah, gather, round, let me drop you a verse, about marriage, that journey, that lifelong curse. Two souls unite, in love they immerse, tying the knot, for better or worse. They say it's a dance, a wild, crazy ride, from the wedding bells chiming, to the quiet bedside. Sharing laughs, sharing tears, side by side, through joys and challenges, they won't hide. But remember, my friend, it's all in good fun, a partnership built, under the same sun. So, here's to love, in all colors it's spun, in this crazy game of marriage, let's all just run. Now let's switch the gears, change up the track, talk about wives, who hustle and don't hold back. Gone are the days when they just sit and slack, they're breadwinners now, that's a solid fact. Breaking stereotypes, they're carving their way, from dawn till dusk, they seize the day. In the corporate world, they fiercely play, with skills and ambition, they're here to stay. Gone are the notions of traditional roles, wives are strong, with their own life goals. Supporting the family, they're taking control, in this evolving world, they're reaching new poles. So here's to the wives, the queens of their reign, shattering ceilings, they thrive, they gain. As breadwinners, they're not just a name, they're writing a new chapter, in the success game. Just kidding, cheers. Now back to business. As joint heads of the family, the two major financial goals you and your spouse must plan for are sufficient funds for your children's education, at least up to college or university level, and sufficient funds for your own retirement as most spouses will more or less retire around the same time. If your two major financial goals in life are the same, then why are a lot of couples doing their own investments? It's a very common phenomenon for one spouse to have a secret fixed deposit account somewhere earning very low returns while their family has a car and, or housing loans or worse still, credit card debts at much higher interest rates. There is a saying that two heads are better than one. As couples, you must break away from the old mindset. You must learn how to work together as a team when it comes to money management and investments. The reason is that each spouse has different investment profiles, which we will explore more on this topic in video 12. For example, one spouse may be good at property investments, the other may be better at investing in the stock market. One spouse may be good at buying, while the other may be better at selling. One spouse may be busy earning money, the other, who could be a homemaker, could be busy investing. Instead of trying to achieve your financial goals on your own, it will be far easier to achieve your goals if you work as a team. I am sure most of you have read books written by Robert Kiyosaki. In most of his books, he always mentions that his wife is his partner in life, his business enterprises and his investments. The key reason he is able to accomplish so much more is because his wife works together with him. Bear this in mind if you want to accomplish all your financial goals quickly and easily. You have to learn to work together with your spouse, not trying to do it on your own. Both of you must have the same financial roadmap and you must be moving in the same direction at the same speed, same page and same pace. Remember, spouses, teamwork, same page and same pace. Consider starting a side income with the description link below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in video 6. Adios.